Howdy folks, hope you're all having a great weekend, and welcome to another Sunday bonus video of Stray, where we've just stolen ourselves a construction worker's hat, and now we need the high visibility jacket to go with it in order to embark upon the next phase of our cunning plan. And for that I'm going to need... Hmm. Sorry, getting distracted, which is appropriate, I am playing a cat after all. <laughs> For that, I'm going to need a cassette tape. And in case you can't remember the previous episode, don't worry, we'll soon see why. And this guy's got a pile of them. Well, I'm... I'm not quite... How can I put this? Personal property is a concept that I just don't get. I'm a cat. I'm wondering if that cable has anything to do with the security cameras that these guys want me to disable for. I mean, I saw the first... Yeah, the cable leads up here. Let, let's, let's see. It's not plugged into anything down there, though, but it... Oh, it's not a cable, it's a water hose. <laughs> Alright, yeah. Fine. Okay, so, cameras. Um, three cameras. Right, there's the one down there that that guy was waving at. I feel like this is here for a reason. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah well, yeah, okay, fair enough. Could have just climbed up to the balcony. Is that it? That doesn't seem to be it. Oh, that is it. Okay, well, that's one camera taken care of. So, where's the second one? Let's have an investigate. Ah, there we go. Ooh, ooh, oh, bugger. I'm not getting back up there, am I? I'm going to have to go down and then up and around again. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's not a problem. So there's one there. And where's the third one? I've definitely only seen two so far, haven't I? I haven't just walked past one and not realised. Well, let's take care of this one while we're here. And, yep, jump over to there. I have to say, whoever installed these things didn't do a very good job. Is that it? Yeah, that's good enough. <laughs> I'm a tiny little ginger cat. I don't weigh that much. So where's number three? Oh, is that it? No, no, that's a sign. Okay, never mind. Where is number three? Is it maybe over the entrance? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Not so smart now, Sentinels. Where is number three? It's certainly not in an obvious location. Man, I'm having to put an awful lot of effort in just to get a cassette tape. Does anybody even remember those, by the way? I feel like cassette tapes and the boombox that that robot's carrying are definitely relics of a bygone era. I have way more cassettes than I had vinyl records. And I had a boombox just like that as well. I wonder... Uh, is there maybe a camera over the entrance? Doesn't appear to be. Where is that third camera? Yeah, because boom boxes like that were um, they were incredibly selfish. Because when you're playing music on one of those things, everybody within a hundred meters is going to hear it, whether they like your choice of music or not. But that was kind of the point. <laughs> it's like musical imperialism. 
but then the Sony Walkman came out and you could uh, listen to stuff privately. So I still had a use for my cassette tapes. And then they brought out the Sony Discman, which was the same thing but for a CD player. And it was bloody awful because every time you joggled it, the CD would skip. Because the problem with cassette tapes was they wore out. But you could copy them. Completely illegal, of course, but I mean, who's going to stop you? Of course, you know, nobody bothers with them anymore, do they? It's all MP3s and street. Ah, I see it. Right, how do I get down there? That, uh, yeah. There it is. So, onto here. Up there. And then wreck the third and final camera. That should do. No funny comments about my weight. And now we go and get ourselves a cassette tape. And then you'll eventually get to see why I need a cassette tape. For those of you who can't remember the last episode, it was like two weeks ago. What's going on over here? Nothing important. Okay. How do I get it downstairs? I, I mean, I could jump, I suppose, but... Where are the stairs? Oh, there they are. Right. So I sorted out your camera problem. Can I have a cassette tape now? <laughs> Check out the dancing robot. <laughs> Damn, the robot's got some moves. Right. So, I have a cassette tape. Now to the clothes shop. I'm going to steal myself a high-vis vest. So that my contact can get me into the factory by posing as one of the workers. There it is. Now in the back room, was it through here or down the other side? There it is. Okay, I apologise for what you're about to hear. It's not my fault, alright? If that doesn't bring the owner and the police running, nothing will. <laughs> and that's awful. But anyway, high vis best acquired. Let's go and see my contact, who I believe goes by the name of Blazer. Here he is. Well, I got your hat. Yeah, yeah, I got the jacket as well. I, I guess. So, oh, you do look very smart, I must say. Oh, oh, I get to go in a box. Best day ever. <laughs> yes, there's been a disturbing lack of boxes in this game so far, at least until you got to Midtown. But in Midtown, there's boxes everywhere. I shouldn't have been surprised that they would be here for a reason. Right, anyway, nothing to see here, just another worker with a box. Yeah, it's just a normal box, just like all of the other boxes, nothing special. That's it. Right, we made it. I've actually forgotten why we're here. <laughs> There's something in the factory that I need to get, but I can't remember what it is. Oh, I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm a pussycat. I'm not supposed to have a long attention span. Right, so, what are we doing here? The workers don't seem to care that there's a cat running around. Oh, I'll bet those robots do. Okay, that's a dead end. I can't go that way. I'm just gonna, yeah, we'll just, we'll just sit in this box until... Oh, actually, no, I can make it. Go, 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 go. Whoa, only just. Right. I think I'm detecting a pattern emerging here. Get caught by the robots, get zapped. Use the boxes to hide. Okay. So, I can use those barrels. Nothing there. But I can use those barrels to skip over the wall. Oh, shit. Oh, oh shit. In the box, in the box, no, 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 in the box, the box, the box, the box, the box, the box, quick! 
<laughs> yeah, it's just a box. There's, there's nothing special about this box. You should go and look for other things. There we go. We're good. So there's a door open over there, but I think I'm going to have to sneak around and just hide in here. Yeah, over that barrel and that barrel. And then jump. And then in through the door. Okay. That's not too bad. Right, let's have a look. There's a closed door over there. Okay, I think I see how this is going to work. Oh, 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 almost, almost. Wait, no, it's not coming all the way back over here. Okay, up onto that, jump onto that, swing over. And now what? Huh. Oh, there's a switch by the door. Gotcha. All right. Activate the switch. And it didn't open the door. Oh, okay, it didn't open the hatch, but it did open the big door over there on the right. So that's obviously where I have to go next. Just going to try to avoid those robots. Got a nice box here I can hide in. Not sure why I need to hide in the box. The robots aren't actually looking over here. Ooh, ooh. Me and my big mouth. No, 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 no. Run, 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 run. Go, 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 Ginger. Run for your life. And we've made it. No, we haven't. Oh, no. <laughs> run, Ginger. Run. Where was that box when I needed it? Oh, my God. Oh, oh no, no. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm fucked again, aren't I? Or am I? Um... How does it not see me? <laughs> oh wow, I don't know how I got away with that one. Um, oh, I see what we're doing. How am I going to get into the shadow created by these blocks of steel without... And, come on, come on, come on, just, just get in the box. Hide. Hide. Wait for it to... Yeah, this is good. This is good. This works. It probably shouldn't, but it does. So... You see? The, yeah, there we go. Come on, come on. That's it. Hide in the shadows. It's a bit like playing inside and getting over the bridge. For those of you who haven't seen that game, it is amazing. Right. And a jump, pity jump, pity jump, jump, jump. And same deal again here, I think. Oh, hang on, there's another switch. Well, it must be there for a reason. Hang on a minute. Isn't this back where we started? Yeah, those are the old drums I jumped over the... Huh. Okay. In the box, quick, quick, quick. This does look very familiar. Those old drums... Behind me, in the water, that's the way I came in. So, unless I've just unlocked the way out after getting what it is that I'm in here to get, which I still can't remember. <laughs> I'm <laughs> not really seeing the point of opening that door by throwing that switch. Oh, this is all very confusing. Yeah. Yeah, this is the way I came in. I'm pretty much right back where I started. Oh, fantastic. I've got to do that all again. Well, I don't have to do it all again. I've already opened the doors. So, maybe all that did was unlock the way out. Either way... Do not turn left when you get to the second set of double doors. Just keep going straight, Ginger. Try to avoid distractions. There we go. And jumpity, 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 jump. Well, we'll, we'll open it since it almost certainly only opens from this side. Don't go that way, Ginger. Tempting though it may be. 
Can we get through here? Nope, nothing to interact with. Okay. Oh, it's getting tricky. We're going to have to swap sides. I see what they're doing. <laughs> Too slow robot drones. Too slow for this cat. And is that it? Have we made it? The, uh... oh right, yeah, that's where they dump all the rubbish. Okay. Yeah, the workers don't really seem to care, do they? Okay, I'm probably not getting through that alive. Oh, hang on. Yep, that'll do the job. Here we go. Let's hope that those lasers don't slice this steel drum <laughs> into a thousand different pieces. Uh, we're gonna live. <laughs> All right. So these floor pressure panels. Oh, atomic battery. That's it. That's why I'm here. I knew I was here for a reason. Right. Okay. So we need to have something that's going to weigh these pressure panels down. What's going on here? What have I done? Oh, right. Now it's following me. Okay. So we've got that one on that panel. Oh, there's another one inside the cage. So we're going to need to get that robot thingy out. I can see a switch in there as well. That probably opens the cage door from the inside. So how am I going to get... I can't turn this, can I? I need to get over the, the fence. And I can't push it. No, and I can't jump from here. I can get over that. Oh, I get it. Right. So we'll uh, just move this out of the way. There we go. That's close enough. Come on in, Ginger. Let's take control of this thing. And come on, over here. Follow me. Good dog. That should be close enough. And now we should be able to, yep, jump over. So we make the switch that should open the yep there we go so now I can move this one and it does work the same way come on good boy follow the pussy cat drop that one there this one get it on the right side there we go follow me over here and okay or not oh I can use the old drum it's the only one I can put the old drum on anyway there we go And that should be it. Hooray! It's the... Oh, that's not good. Looks like I've just killed power to the factory. <laughs> They're probably going to come and investigate that. <laughs> yes. Let's get out of here before the Sentinels show up. And we're going... Oh... Remember when I first arrived in Midtown, I saw this bucket and was desperately trying to get over here because I thought it was some kind of secret that it's the way out of the factory. Okay, I'm glad I'm not going crazy. I knew it was there for a reason. Right then, Clementine, I've got your battery thing. I can't remember why you wanted it, but um, <laughs> I'm a cat. I have a short attention span, but I have got it. Which way does she live? Was it down there? No. Is it? Oh, that doesn't look good. That, that looks very ungood, in fact. I think Clementine may have been arrested. Well, 
Join me and Ginger in the next episode where we'll have to put our investigating hat on and find out what happened to Clementine because that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you've all been having a great weekend. And as always, take care, stay safe, and I'll catch you next time.